guys, it's Cassandra. Welcome to my YouTube channel, or welcome back to my YouTube channel. Um, today I'm going to be talking about healing crystals and how they have um, changed my life. Um, so, with a bit of a backstory, real quickly. Um, I've always been somebody that struggles with mental health. From age 15 to now, I've always suffered from anxiety, have really bad panic attacks and depression. So the reason that I use hearing crystals is to help manage that. So I'm gonna show you guys my crystals and what they mean. Um, so first I have this like white one and I, I got my uh, handy dandy crystal book here to tell me what it means. Um, I think it's uh, Tremulated, no, no, it's not that one. All right, well, I can't find this one, but this one, I don't know what it's called. Um, let's see. Um, Oh, this one is called Paralyte Abundance Rock Reflects Negativity. So basically, this one blocks negativity. Um, this one is a Rose Cortez, which is, represents love, beauty, and happiness. Okay, and this one looks like it's an amulet. Uh, oh, spirituality, introduction, and peace. Um, a lot of Rose Cortez. Uh, okay, this one. Um, it looks like that one. Mm. All right, I don't think this one is in here. Um, I think this one is rough at all. Uh, creativity, change, and positivity. Oh wait, no, that's this one. My bad. I don't know what that one is. This one is probably an amulet too. Um... This one is Surlight Cleansing Healing Protection. Clear Cortez. Um, this is, yeah, Let's see if I can find that. No. All right, well, that's enough of that. So what I do with these is 
I simply just hold them. Um, you can hold them while you meditate or you can just hold them when you're feeling anxious and not yourself. And what they do based on what they represent is they help release the stress or anxiety of what you've been feeling or it can bring happiness, peace, anything that you want. Um, basically, crystals take a little bit of time to work. For me, it didn't work right away. You have to keep um, like meditating and like practicing and holding different types of crystals and find out which one speaks to you. So don't expect it to work the first time that you hold a crystal. Like I said, it just takes time. But you'll get there eventual, eventually. Um, when you do, I promise you, it, it'll be all worth it and it'll change your life. <laughs> Um, okay. Okay. So, there's one other thing that I use. Um, this is called a essential oil diffuser. And as you can see, there is, uh, air coming out of the top of it. And what I do with that is you buy regular essential oils, just like these. Um, so I have lavender, it smells really good, <laughs> and I have rose. I usually just go back and forth between the two. Um, I don't know what rose will do for you, but I just really like the smell of it. Um, lavender is supposed to help calm you down, and this is the one that I use the most because I suffer from really bad anxiety. So what you do is you take this part off and you take this white part off and inside is like a, a circle and you fill it with water and you put just a tiny, tiny drop of essential oil into it and it'll make your room smell like essential oil and whatever essential oil that you picked it'll help you it'll help calm you down pretty cool right and this also can change colors but i don't want to turn it off right now i don't want to mess with it right now um all right well that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and until next time. Bye